newly hatched forest cobra draws her first breath and rests for a moment. A creature sometimes revered, but mostly feared. Born fully independent, instinct is already driving her. A powerful array of finely tuned senses is firing up. Her mission is to survive. And to survive, she must kill. She's on her own, and dangers abound. She may be the only one of 13 siblings to survive. But she's a natural born killer. Equipped with an inherited arsenal of deadly weapons and characteristic Cobra bad attitude. Her presence stirs fear as her family name and reputation precedes her. For good reason. Petal might be at her most vulnerable right now. But she's a little hunter in the making and will soon see just what she's capable of. For she belongs to a veteran gang of predators who rule the reptilian streets of Africa and Asia. The Cobra Mafia is a group of ruthless hitmen, each equipped with a set of skills to run their operations. Unlike most other groups of snake species, they're armed with hollow fangs designed like hypodermic needles used to inject deadly venom into their victims. But it's their trademark move and iconic shape that distinguishes them from most other serpents. Raising a third of their body length off the ground, they use specially adapted muscles to expand modified ribs. And stretching their neck skin, they form hoods, striking the defense pose that has terrified their enemies for centuries. But there are imposters within their ranks. Cousins who have mastered the move, even employ the hooding. And their behavior behind closed doors doesn't comply with the strict Cobra code of conduct. Is this a family of cold-blooded killers? Or have they just earned a bad reputation?